for this spring, Eliza. Be a Ritz. Try it again, shall we? The rain in Spain stays mainly in the plain. The rain in Spain stays mainly in the plain. What was that? The rain in Spain stays mainly in the plain. I think she's got it. I think she's got it. The rain. She's got it. By George, she's got it. Now, once again, where does it rain? On the plane, on the plane. And where's that soggy plane? In Spain, in Spain. Spain, in Spain, stays mainly in the plane. <laughs> In Hartford, Hereford, and Hampshire. Hurricanes hardly happen. Present yourself. How kind of you to let me come. Now once again, where does it rain? On the plane. On the plane. And where's that blasted plane? In Spain. Take the missus a trip to Brighton. Oh, thank you, Mr. Doolittle. Oi! Have a look out for you. In a couple hours, you've got to be at the church. How much time have I got left? A few more hours before they tie the knot. There are drinks and girls all over London. And I have to track them down in just a few more hours. I'm getting married in the morning. Ding dong, the bells are gonna chime. Pour out the stopper. Let's have a whopper. Get me to the church on time. I'm gonna be there in the morning. Spruced up and looking in me cry. Tommy, all out the army, get me to the 
I've grown accustomed to her face. She almost makes the day begin. I've grown accustomed to the tune. She whistles night and noon. Her smiles, her frowns, her ups, her downs are second nature to me now. Like breathing out and breathing in. I was supremely independent and content before we met. <laughs> Surely I could always be that way again. And yet, I've grown accustomed to her looks, accustomed to her voice, accustomed to her face. Marry Freddie, what an infantile idea. What a heartless, wicked, brainless thing to do. But she'll regret it. She'll regret it. It's doomed before they even take the vow. I can see her now, Mrs. Freddy Ainsford Hill, in a wretched little flat above a store. I can see her now, not a penny in the till, and a bill collector beating at the door. She'll try to teach the things I taught her, and end up selling flowers instead. Begging for her bread and water While her husband has his breakfast in bed In a year or so When she's prematurely grey And the blossom on her cheek has turned to chalk She'll come home and lo He'll have upped and run away With a social climbing heiress from New York Poor Eliza How simply frightening How humiliating how delightful. <laughs> but I'm a most forgiving man, the sort who never could, ever would, take a position and staunchly never budge. <laughs> Just the most forgiving man. But I will never take a back. 
Let a promise to a toe. Let a shiver, let a moan. I will slam the door and let the Hellcat freeze. Marry Freddy. Ha! But I'm so used to hear her say, Good morning every day. Her joys, her woes, her highs, her lows are second nature to me now. Like breathing out and breathing in. I'm very grateful she's a woman and so easy to forget. Rather like a habit one can always break. And yet, I've grown accustomed to the sense of something in the air, accustomed to her face. I want to be a lady in a flower shop, instead of selling flowers at the corner of Tottenham Court Road. But they won't take me unless I talk more genteel. He said he could teach me. Well, here I am, ready to pay him, not asking any favour, and he treats me as if I were dirt. I know what lessons cost as well as you do, and I'm ready to pay. It's almost irresistible. She's so deliciously low, so horribly dirty. I washed my face and hands before I came. I did. Eliza? Where the devil are my slippers? <laughs> <laughs>